Okay, so Jack escapes with Chloe. That's where we, we pick the picking up. And they all meet at this hacker's uh, base. It's a place where these hackers all are working on their computers, you know, all these great brains. And Jack is realizing that one of the hackers, one of Chloe's hacker friends are missing. So Chloe wasn't there. Chloe doesn't know what's happening. So he asked one of the other hackers, where's uh, Yates? That's his guy's name, Yates. Derek Yates, where's Yates? And the guy doesn't want to say. Of course, Jack has to get hard with him, you know. He pulls out his gun and he puts it to his head and he says, T where is Gates? Tell me where Gates is. All right. And so the guy, of course, you know, says where Gates is hiding. Gates is hiding in our heroin-ridden neighborhood, uh, like, you know, with a lot of low lives, like the underbelly of society type people. And he's there um, because he figures that's a place where no one will look for him. And he's there with his girlfriend all hot, hidden. Now, he's looking for Yates because Yates is, is thought to be the hacker or is assumed to be the hacker that hacked into the computers that killed the four soldiers with, with the drones. In other words, Lieutenant Tanner didn't know anything about it. He didn't do it. He really is innocent. This Derek Yates is the one who redirected the missiles. So, now the chase is on for Derek Yates. So, um, Jack, Bauer, and Chloe O'Brien go chasing for Yates. They go into the ghetto to find Yates. Kate, Morgan, Agent Navarro, and that CIA crew, they're chasing Jack. So now they both meet at the same spot because that's where Derek Yates is. And because Jack's chasing Derek Yates, Jack's there too now. All right, so they all meet. These three parties meet in the heroin written apartment building there. And then there's more fighting, more bullets. Um, Jack is trying to escape, but he's trying to get Derek Yates to give up this device that he's been using to redirect the drone missiles. Because as you know, if you can direct, redirect missiles, all of us are at risk. Everybody, you know, he can just point these missiles at anyone. So he's running and running, and here comes Derek Yates with his girlfriend. They run right past Kate, but Kate doesn't know she's after Jack. She should be after Derek Yates too, but she's not. She's after Jack. So she says, you know, have you seen the so-and-so man with, you know, and it's so funny because Derek Gay said, yeah, you know, he plays the old game. The guy's back there, you know, okay? So it's a diversion type situation. So now Kate's, she finds Jack chasing Derek. She holds Jack up with the gun like she's going to shoot him with all her people. In the meantime, Derek Gates gets away. So Derek Gates escapes with his girlfriend. He and his girlfriend think they got away, which they did. But something happens because Derek Yates and his girlfriend, they love each other so much. Allegedly, that's what is shown. But then when they're by themselves, the girlfriend pretends like she's going to kiss and make love to him and stabs him to death. And then takes his device, the drone device that everybody's after. Well, the Jack's after. And that soon everybody, the whole world will be after once they find out that they, this Derek Yates had the ability to hack into the military's um, weapons like that. And so that's where we are. And um, we're going to see what's going to happen. This, this, uh, let's see, it's 10 more episodes because we saw two. They showed two last night. So we'll see what's happening. But so far it's heating up. It looks like it's going to be good. Check your local listings. It's a Fox program. It's called 24. It stars Keith Sutherland. And until we meet again, oh, well, Thank you for joining me for my television recap of 24. I enjoy telling it. I hope you enjoy listening. I enjoy talking now, right? I get it. Okay. Thank you for joining me for the recap of 24, the television series premiere. I'll see you sometime soon, maybe on the finale, maybe before that. Let me know if you need me to do more. I'm always happy to come and talk to you. You know I love this kind of stuff, right? Anyway, God bless. Now, until we meet again, it's Renee Stanley for a movie review relay.